Living in a state with such easy access to the outdoors makes Colorado special. Our now science is offering more on how our relationship with nature can make us healthier. Nine News reporter Mark Salander shows us why we just need to step outside and listen. In a year when so much relies on technology. I think the moral of the story is that to get outside. The sounds of stillness are not only soothing, science says they're good for us. We actually have pretty good evidence that there's um, major health benefits to being exposed to nature. George Wittemeyer has a pretty cool job. He's a professor at CSU in the Fish, Wildlife, Conservation, Biology Department. He's on the hunt to find the most soothing nature sounds all around the country, all in the name of science. The evidence is really clear. So listening to natural sounds uh, reduces stress, reduces annoyance, um, and it's, uh, and it's uh, correlated with positive health benefits. George is a co-author of a new study that examined how nature sounds impact the body. Researchers analyzed recordings from more than 60 national parks to determine what impacts our health the most. The study found sounds of water are most effective at improving emotions, while bird sounds combat stress. They've really gotten a lot of us through this pandemic. Rachel Buxton is another author of the study from Carleton University in Canada and a former postdoctoral student at CSU. She says sound can be just as beautiful as the sights we see. We just have to stop and listen. Close your eyes and, and listen to what's around you. Listen to the birds singing and you know the wind rustling the leaves and the trees. So close the Zoom and take a hike. It's good for you. Mark Salinger, 9 News. Who needs an app? You've got Colorado. Researchers have been working with the National Park Service to help preserve natural soundscapes from the sounds of cars and airplanes, and they hope to one day even put signs on trails reminding people to stop and listen.